you guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to use green screens and overlays in your videos so one question that i get all the time is where do i get my green screens and overlays so i get them right here on youtube and all i do is search for like film overlay and you'll see like a bunch of results pop up or I'll look up green screen overlay and again, a bunch of results will pop up. After I find the overlays that I wanna use, I'll just screen record those and use them in my videos. So first I'm gonna be showing you guys how to use green screens and overlays in Adobe Premiere Pro. So all you have to do is insert your clip and then on top of your clip, you wanna put in your green screen. Then you want to go to your effects and you want to search ultra key. Ultra key will allow you to delete the green part of the video. Take ultra key and drag it to your green screen clip. In the effects control, you'll see the ultra key drop down. So use the eyedropper tool and select the green part of your video and it'll delete the green screen. That way you can see the stars and you can see your video that was underneath the green screen. For film overlays and stuff like that, it's gonna be a little bit different because those aren't green screens, they're just actual video clips. So as you can see, I have a film overlay on top of my video clip. So what I'm gonna do is select the vintage video clip and go over to effects control and you're gonna select blend mode. In blend mode, the two options that I always use is either screen or overlay. You can play with this and see which one looks best. In this case, I just chose screen. So when you play it back, it'll have kind of like that static um, vintage feel, but you won't actually see that video on top of it. So that's how you do it for Adobe Premiere Pro. And now I'm gonna show you guys in iMovie. So in iMovie, you just wanna bring in your clip. So you have your regular clip, then you want to bring in your green screen. When you bring in your green screen, you'll have add to movie or you can do the more option. Click the more option and then you'll see a whole list of different options, but you're gonna select the green slash blue screen. And what that's gonna do is just import the green screen and get rid of the green part. And when you play it back, you'll have, you know, everything there except for the green screen. Another way to do this is if you have your clip already in video section of iMovie, click on the actual clip and then you'll see the three dot option and then it'll also give you those options as well and you'll just click again green slash blue screen and it'll go ahead and insert your green screen into the video. And that is it. That is how you add overlays and green screens onto your videos. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.